Hollywood has a bad track record from way back, of course, uh, showing ethnic minority groups of all kinds. You know, Native Americans, uh, African Americans were always caricatured, almost always. Japanese Americans, Chinese Americans. All these groups were depicted usually in stereotypical ways. The Japanese character is somewhat stereotypical, you know. It is controversial, of course, when you have what they call yellow face now with white actors doing Japanese parts. Christopher Lee is the dreaded Dr. Fu Manchu. That Dr. Ingrid Koch will die an extremely painful death. In Hollywood, white actors are really the, at the top of the, the food chain. They get access to all the lead roles. They are, um, they even can play, you know, characters of color. Robbery ladies, kind of gentlemen, please to introduce myself. Sakini by name, interpreter by profession. very different from actors of color, especially Asian American actors who rarely even get to play themselves because white actors are sometimes taking that role. Um, and, and so not only are Asian American actors not part of the lead and being able to kind of build their uh, star power, so then it becomes the cyclical problem where they're not getting cast as leads and so then they don't become A-list actors, so then people are thinking, oh, well, we can't cast an Asian to play this role because they're not A-list, they're not gonna you know, be able to draw any audiences, so let's, ca let's cast an A-list white actor instead to play that. And that has been the historical trend amongst, um, amongst the casting of Asian uh, actors compared to white actors.